All right, what's good YouTube? It's Shin and today I'm coming to you from Chinatown where we are going to China Mama, one of the best rated restaurants here in the city. We're going to go and get some amazing Asian food. Really glad to have you along with me. Let's go check it out. Alrighty, you guys, so we just got seated here inside of China Mama, classic Asian restaurant feel. They've got that nice old Chinese decor, a little bit of mood lighting here as well. There are a lot of people waiting here as the restaurant was opening, so you know it's good. All right, you guys, let me give you a look at the menu. You can see here they've got their house specialties. Really good looking. Additional specialties down here. Now what I love about China Mama is not only do they specialize in Chinese cuisine, but they also have really great options from Szechuan cuisine, like that dry pepper chicken and mabo tofu, really using a lot of those numbing peppers. The crispy beef here is also incredibly popular. Now you can see here with the other dishes, appetizers, beef, pork, and soup, lots of great Chinese options here, classic options. And the seafood paste vegetables, noodles, rice, and desserts here. Feel free to give this a pause to take a closer look, but this is all looking really, really good. And then taking a look on the reverse side of that menu, mostly the back side of this menu is really highlighting a lot of those signature dishes here at China Mama. And this is all looking really, really good. Now, a lot of really great options here, serve family style, so it's great to come with family and friends. And we do have a pretty big order in today, so I'm gonna show you guys a lot of really great food. But I'll see you when the first plate arrives. All right, you guys, our first entree has arrived and it's the crispy beef. This is looking so good. Beautiful plating, love seeing that glaze glistening in the light here. Absolutely loving how crispy this feels in my chopsticks. Let's give it a bite. Mm. Oh, that is delicious. Great crispy texture, I love the crunch. The glaze has a little bit of a heat element to it, but a really nice sweet flavor as well. You can actually see the little bits of pepper seeds in here. Really nicely developed flavors, well balanced. Not overly sweet, it's not overly spicy either. Really, really well made. All right, you guys, that crispy beef was so amazing. And what I love about Asian cuisine is how quickly the rest of the food comes out. We have the rest of our order. This is looking so good. You could see this delicious looking mabo tofu with that deep red. You know it's gonna be nice and spicy. Got these beautiful Taiwanese beef rolls. And alongside that is this Szechuan dry pepper chicken made with numbing peppers. This is such a hugely popular dish in Chinese cuisine and it's looking phenomenal. And then of course, we have these soup dumplings, these pork shaolong baos here that's looking really, really good. I can't wait to try all of this food, you guys. Let's go. Alrighty, you guys, the next bite I wanna try is of this hot dry pepper Szechuan chicken. I love the big chunks of numbing peppers you can see on this. Crispy to the touch. Let's give it a try. Mmm. Man, that's good. The crispy exterior has housed so much of that numbing pepper oil. There's a really great saltiness to it as well. After you get past that crunchy batter is this really juicy succulent chicken. And then that little bit of residual heat that it leaves behind. It's really, really good, you guys. All right, you guys, next up, let's go ahead and try the mabo tofu. Mabo tofu is a spicy tofu dish that's cooked in a pork reduction, typically eaten on top of rice because it is pretty spicy. Let's give this a try. Mm. Oh yeah, that's good. Tofu's been well cooked, nice and firm. You get really great heat. That pork sauce definitely gives a little bit of salinity and then the rice helps to mellow out some of that heat. This is a really good bite. All right, the spice is nice, but let's go and try these Taiwanese beef rolls next. Now, Taiwanese beef rolls are typically little slices of beef wrapped up in a rice wrapper, fried. Let's give it a try. Mm. Yeah, that's really good. 
The rice wrapping has been really well fried in something that has a little bit of a hint of sesame oil, which is a nice nuttiness. The beef inside is tender. You get a little bit of that sweetness from the hoisin in there. And then the cilantro gives just a little bit of additional bite. This is really, really good, you guys. All right, you guys, and the last thing to try here that we've ordered are these pork shaolong baos. Now, typically when eating shaolong bao, you want to go ahead and create a small puncture here, which allows you to just suck out that delicious gelatinous soup inside. Oh, nice and meaty. Really great developed flavors in that broth, in the dumpling. And then we go ahead and try the whole thing. Oh man, that's really great. The Shaolong Bao skin has been nicely steamed. The pork inside is really tender, really well seasoned, but it's really that soup base. It has so much depth of flavor. Pork, garlic, ginger. It's really tasty, you guys. And as you can see, guys, this is really, really great stuff. We're so happy with the food right now. I'm gonna go ahead and chow down. Not sure if I have room for dessert here, but we'll see. I'll catch you in a little bit. Alrighty, you guys, so we just finished up eating and I'm sure you saw how much food we had. We are so stuffed. I don't think dessert's really an option today. That said, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for being here along with us. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. I'd love for more people to see this place. And if you're looking for more videos from here in Las Vegas, make sure that you subscribe to the channel. I've got a lot of great content coming your way. And that's all for this one. Have a great day and I hope you enjoy Vegas with me. Shin, bye.